Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you my flat iron routine. And first, I'm just starting out by dividing my hair into four sections, as you can see, just to get the hair out of the way so I can work on one section at a time. And then I'm just taking my Tresemme Thermal Creations heat protectant and I'm going to spray that in my hair as I flat iron it. And I'm using my Sea-Doo Professional Flat Iron which I did recently pick up on Amazon for about 65 bucks I believe. And I do like to do the chase method when I'm flat ironing my hair just to make sure I get all the tangles out as I am flat ironing it and make it a little bit smoother. And the flat iron is set in between 360 and 410, with 410 being the highest temperature, which I try to stay away from using the highest. I usually like to flat iron my hair on 375, but this particular flat iron doesn't have that specific temperature setting, so that's why I put it between the 360 and 410. And I'm just gonna speed through this process because it's pretty self-explanatory. I'm sure everybody gets the idea of how to do this. And definitely always use heat protectant when you are flat ironing your hair. You don't want to burn your hair off. And I have definitely cut back on flat ironing. I used to flat iron once a week, which I don't do that anymore because it was causing a lot of split ends and I'm trying to retain as much length as I possibly can. So I limited that to about once a month and I can definitely tell a difference and I've definitely retained a lot more length this year than last year. Basically, this is what it looked like once I was finished. And here's a view from the back. And I did actually go in the next morning to retouch up my roots because they weren't as flat as I would like them to be. And I'm just adding some of my finishing polish, which I did purchase at my local salon. And I'm just adding that in for a little bit of shine, as you can see. So basically, this is the finished look. Thanks everybody for watching, and I will see you in the next video.